today we're going to be revisiting an older video to see what sold, what I made a profit on, and what I probably could have left on the shelf. We are here at the Penn Mar Antique Market. I've never been here before. I'm kind of excited. I called ahead, I got permission to film, and we're gonna check it out and see what we can find that we can buy and flip for a profit. Got some raku over here, look at this. Like a wait, oh look, oh, I love raku. And it's signs, what was the price on that? I love raku. $7.50? Yes, please, get in my basket. Wow, that thing's crazy looking. Kind of reminds me of a hot air balloon. This is interesting. That looks like it might be made in Italy. Yeah, look at that made in Italy. It's got a little bit of a, well, actually, it's got a few chips on there. But I kind of like that for $5. I feel like five bucks is a good price for that. Could at least double my money on that. All right. There's actually this little doggy right there. Sure, That's really hurry. cute. I think the little elephant too is adorable. He is cute. Go ahead and look at whatever you <laughs> oh, want. Oh, thank to you hide. so much. Oh, it's a little trinket box. It is. Isn't that cute? Yeah. Oh my goodness. Oh, I love it. All right. Yeah. Look at these mushrooms. Aren't these really fun? Oh my gosh, there's two of them. <laughs> okay. Yes. I will. Oh my gosh. Look at this turtle box. What? Eight dollars. Hand painted in Mexico. Oh, I thought for a second that it was going to be paper mache. It's actually. Oh, it's terracotta. I almost wonder if it's signed on the bottom. I'm a little nervous. My hands are full. I can't really hear. Let's balance that right there. Let's see. Oh, there's no markings on it. I mean, clearly it is. This is South American. Central American. Mexico. I almost wonder if that's Peru, though. I don't know. I love it. I love those colors. I'm really drawn to the colorful stuff, you guys. Know that? For only eight bucks? Let's do it. All right, so the music is super loud right now, but I'm gonna try to talk over it. There is a set of tea lights here uh, for $40. They are Lithuania. These ones set on here, like, I guess this one may be broken. Is it broken or is it supposed to sit like that? I think it's supposed to sit like that, so I'm not really sure what's going on here. I think it's, yeah. And then you put the tea light in there and then it lights up, but I love the detail of the houses. I think they're just absolutely stunning. Handwork, Lithuania. And um, I, so I think for three of them, for $40, I think I'm gonna do that because look, I love that robin's egg blue of the houses. I think that's just amazing. So let's grab all three of them for $40. Check him out. Is he not amazing? <laughs> We recently sold a horse that was Mexican pottery. This is a Mexican pottery dog. Um, he is cobalt. He's not that really fun chartreuse green. But he's still just as fun and whimsical. He's got that bone in his mouth. I almost thought he was a canister, but he's clearly not. Um, he's got a little bit of a marking there. I'm, I'm fairly certain that he's pretty modern, but... I think I'm gonna grab him for 20 bucks. Our, our um, horse did really well, and I wasn't sure if the horse did really well because of the color or not, but I, I'm really digging the puppy dog. I really like him, look at his bone. He's great, so we're gonna grab him for 20. He's a pretty decent size, so we'll see how he does. All right, well our total spend was just over 300. I feel like we got some good things though. I feel like I'm really excited for those little houses. 
I've never seen those before. I mean, I've seen little houses that are made in Lancaster County, Pennsylvania, but I haven't seen the little Lithuania houses. And I like those. I love the detail that went into making those. I also like the little Mexican, well, I shouldn't say little. He was pretty big, the Mexican pottery dog. He was he was pretty great. But I am gonna get out of here now. I'm gonna head down the road. There is a Goodwill. I'm gonna check it out. If you don't see a video, it's because it wasn't that great. But if you do see a video, I mean, hey, things panned out, but um, I haven't heard that it's very big. So I'm not sure if we're gonna find anything, but I will keep you posted. Thanks for watching and I hope you enjoyed this video. In case you spotted something you just can't live without, we do post 25 to 30 new items in our eBay shop every single day. And I've posted a link to that down in the description. If you enjoyed this video, we will be posting videos just like this every Wednesday, Friday, and Sunday. So make sure you stay tuned, make sure you hit the subscribe button. And I have included a link to the playlist down in the description.